good morning students today i am showing you some very common apparatuses which are used in a chemistry laboratory okay so i begin with the test tube stand now this is a wooden stand sometimes there are plastic stands also all right plastic are better because wood reacts with certain chemicals as you can see here but plastic usually does not react so we use it for keeping the test tubes this is how we keep the test tubes here okay these are the test tubes all right they are of various capacities they are made up of a very good quality glass which does not breaks easily okay this is of about 20 ml capacity all right this is the uh, name of the glass borosilicate glass is used for making these test tubes so this is written over here this is called a test tube holder so when we are heating a test tube we just hold it with this holder like this okay and then we heat the test tube like this so this is very convenient to use after this this is a beaker this is of 50 ml capacity it's used for keeping liquids this is another beaker this is a bigger one now on this beaker you can see there are various graduations present here okay it is it is a graduated beaker 100 ml 200 300 500 ml till 500 ml graduations are present so this is also used for measuring various volumes of liquids now this is a test tube brush okay so we just put it inside the test tube all right completely inside now this has got some substance fixed on it obviously it is dirty but anyway this is a brush we use it for cleaning the test tubes now this is a bottle it's a glass bottle which we in which we keep various substances this is called a reagent bottle it's completely made up of glass along with the stopper so that it might not react with the chemicals then these are some um uh glass uh these are called watch glasses they are just used for observing various substances we take out the substance okay we put it in these watch glasses and we observe the substance so this is a watch glass now we have another apparatus over here now this is called a mortar its pestle is not here i'll show it to you later on so this is called a mortar we use it for grinding usually this is something which people have in their houses also okay now this is called a spatula for taking out various substances then we have another apparatus this is a uh you as you already know this is a dropper okay so i'll show you one another very important apparatus this is called a bunsen burner this is a bunsen burner all right so it has openings here and there's a opening here also all right through which the gas comes out and it burns usually the bunsen burner runs on the lpg gas so this is the knob for opening and closing the gas now i'll show you the remaining apparatuses later on in another video